Hey guys, Kevin Book 2, The Dude Bites, and today I'm going to be solving a Rubik's Cube. This is actually a Duncan Cube. As you can see. You can't see because of camera blur and unfocusment. I believe I recorded a video like this probably a year ago when, I, maybe even probably more like two years ago, when I originally saw, learned how to solve a Rubik's Cube, I believe I uploaded, I recorded like a week after I learned how, and I don't think I ever uploaded it. So I think it's only fitting to actually record me solving it now that I can properly. So let's just give it a good scramble. This cube, I believe I got for $6 at um, a local, um, like a local market. Not a supermarket, more like a general store. It's not a gas station, but they, 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 I got this at Eli's near me. Yes, but um, so I, so though I basically have this cube and it's pr it's decently fast for a six dollar cube <laughs> that I got just instead of like some candy. Anyway, I'll show you. Anyway, I'm going to describe what I'm doing as I'm doing it. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is solving the white lit. No, is solving the white cross, which is the first step to actually solving a Rubik's cube using the beginner method. As you can see, there's like a cross shape right here going through the middle. Now, the sides here all line up. So, the next step is to put the corners in place. Now, to be able to solve a Rubik's Cube, you don't just solve it side by side. That is very inefficient and it would take you a long time to do it. Anyway, as you can see, the whole bottom layer is completely done. That means that the entire bottom layer is fully in place and it will be for the entire rest of the solve, pretty much. Now I'm gonna go for the second layer. So, so what I'm actually doing is I just put this piece right here into place and it appears as if I um, did something wrong. So there, now I did it right. This piece right here is actually where it's supposed to be in the final solve. So I'm just so now, so now the entire second layer is solved. Now I'm going to make a cross on the top. Now this is a lot easier than the first because we already have a cross. Now I'm going to align the corners. Basically, so that so these two corners both have an orange side on them, but this is blue and it's on the green side, and this oh, and this is green, but it's on the blue side. So we need to switch these. You can do that with a couple quick turns, and you could do that in a couple quick turns. And now the now these two corners are where they're supposed to be. Now these corners are already where they're supposed to be, so we're good there. Now we have to make it so that the corners are facing the right way, and we can just do that with um, this. So now we're almost done solving this. When first solving a Rubik's Cube and getting this, you may think that your life may be over because you just spent all that work and you got here. This is really easy to fix. All you have to do is you have to do a quick algorithm so that you have one side already in place. If you already have one side in place, then solving the other three should be very quick and simple as you just have to do a simple algorithm and the entire cube is solved. I'm going to scramble this up once more and solve it again. I might actually do it a third time 
mostly for watch time and so that I can entertain whoever actually watches this. <laughs> um, so, now instead of explaining what I'm doing as I'm doing it, I'm just going to show you what I've done, so. That's the first layer done completely. Now the second layer is done. And now it's solved. I am going to solve this once more so that I can get this video up for eight minutes so that if I ever wind up getting monetized on YouTube, I will be able to earn money from this. Why am I just saying that I'm recording a longer video to make money? I don't even have like 30 subs. Yet. And I probably won't. So why am I even doing this? Honestly. And that is done. Anyway, thank you guys so so much for watching. If you've made it to that point, if you made it to this point, if you feel like it, please like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell for when I upload like once a month or once every two months or something like that, because I don't upload often. Anyway, that's it for me today. You're probably not uh Your channel that you watch sometimes, the dude rides. Goodbye! <laughs>